Can we help? Speak to him first. Oh, sorry. sorry. Yeah. Yeah. The longest. <laughs> I'm longest serving presenter. Yes. Um, which was, what was your most memorable moment? I know the moment you left, obviously, was a big one, but what, what, what did you most enjoy? He doesn't do that. was the one the audience most enjoyed. <laughs> 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 this, this young lady's been very well briefed. She has. I have, haven't yeah. I? I've yeah. been watching you. So, what was your most memorable uh, moment? That's what I thought out of the aeroplane. Going, going up that mast. But jumping up that aeroplane was really something as well, wasn't it? Because, yeah. are we, I mean, were you scared for your life at any point? Or you thought, oh, it's no, going to be Peter, it's OK. I, I trained. I'd, I'd done about 29 jumps before that. I used to jump with the army just for fun on right. weekends. Go down to Netherhaven. That was great. I was, was an idiot. <laughs> We're going to watch a little clip, actually. Um, we've been showing it on breakfast this morning. I think at the Ivory Coast this was, oh, yeah. when you two went out in a canoe, you were safely on the beach. Oh, yes. Um, you're wearing some particularly fetching swimming trunks, <laughs> we're going to call them. Let's have a look, shall we? I think we can sit over there. We asked the men of Azwerti if we could join them. They'd never taken any passengers before, but we were so keen to try, they said, yes, but at your own risk. And Leslie, they wouldn't take on any account. John and Pete had been allowed to go because they're strong swimmers, and I could see why I'd been left behind. Somebody of my size could easily get swept away. From the shore, we could tell the canoe was sinking, and I began to wonder if I'd ever see John and Pete again. All of a sudden, we realised the crew had begun to abandon ship. By now, the canoe seemed more like a submarine than a boat. So although we'd been told to hang on, whatever happened, Pete and I decided our best chance of survival was to follow our leaders. At that moment, I thought they'd drowned, so it was marvellous when, in between the breakers, I could see heads bobbing up and down and everyone clinging to the upturned boat. <laughs> a bit of drama on the beach. Oh, yeah. Big all... surfer. They all abandoned surf. ship. We, we were sitting there, actually, as we pulled, you know, there was shouting, pull! So we were pulling away like this. Eventually, there were the two of us, everyone else had abandoned it. <laughs> they all jumped we off. So that was it, and then we went over, and that, that was the end of it. It was quite... The dangerous thing was, uh, once we were out of the boat, that, that was no problem, we can both swim. Yes, yeah, yeah. Or yeah. it's deep and, uh, and all that. The boat came in with us, and so you could... And it was heavy, it was wood, it wasn't, it wasn't a soft canoe. That was a mm. seriously yeah. heavy thing. Yeah. And if that hits us, we, you're dead. Yeah. The thing that you missed was that fin. <laughs> no, I didn't see that. No, 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 no. I'd have been out much quicker if I had. Um, let's talk a little bit about the animals, because we've met a couple of them, the, the current animals who are on the programme, Mabel and Lucy. Um, Shep, I, I remember famously, yeah. who you were very fond of, weren't you? Yeah. Oh, he was a lovely old dog. He, uh, he knew what I was going to say before I said it. No, that's me. <laughs> oh, that <laughs> the dog didn't know anything. The dog was a dog. The dog had to learn his well, I trained you as well. <laughs> did you? Uh, yeah. And did he, did he actually, you took him home and stuff, did you? Did oh, you yes, do? yeah, he lived, lived with me, yeah. Mm. Um, looking back, do you, I mean, how important do you think, it's 50 years, amazing, yeah. this programme. Yeah. It's still important to kids, do you think? Yes, it obviously is. Obviously it it is. wouldn't still exist it's... if it wasn't. I mean, I, I think there's always going to be a place for a programme like Blue Peter, whether it's Blue Peter for another 50 years, which I... Doubt very much. I mean, well, I don't. I don't. I disagree. You, you I think, think it might still be well going yeah. Blue Peter in another fifty yeah. years. It's one of the only things that it, it's the, uh, one of the only continuous things left in this world mm. now. You yeah. know. But I, I remember when we everything's we, new. When we but buried Blue Peter them, still keeps going. The box for the millennium that which, which I always thought was rather odd, but I mean, none of us expected that the show would still be going then. We could, yeah. In in two thousand. And it was, and so we went back and we dug it up. Of course, all the stuff in it was ruined, but there we go. That's Tell you what, was it, ru story. Well, it was ruined, was it? Well, yeah, it's we didn't have shrink wrap no, in no, those no, days. No, it was, it was uh, yeah, it was all, all pulped. When but I die, you can bury me. Yes. Well. Today. <laughs> yeah, if you like, yeah. I'll be good. That would be good. By Petra statue. Oh, <laughs> uh, um, yes, and Petra. I mean, things have <clears> changed because Petra actually. Um, she was I'd, mine on the. Yeah, she was mine, but she was she was changed, wasn't she? What do you mean she was no, changed? No, no, you're, you're Wasn't mixing. it a new Petra, or was that, well, was that no, a different the, dog? No, but I mean... The, <laughs> well, the, the, the story is it's very, very simple, Go on. and it was absolutely correct what happened. The puppy was shown on the programme, they yes. said, this is the new puppy, so-and-so, and so-and-so, and, so, and between then and its next appearance on the programme, that puppy died. So it had been seen once. And the programme, what do they do? They say to an audience of 7 to 12-year-olds, because that was the target that audience, still died. is, yeah. that lovely little puppy is... You know, you can't do that. 
So they scoured the South London pet shops, Edward Barnes with a photograph saying, we've got a ringer for this, and, and they ended up with the Petra that became the Petra. Yes. So she was, no one knew her breathing or anything. She was a, a, a mongrel, she was a German Shepherd yeah. collie cross of some kind. But I loved I'm her, she was I'm glad you've got she it straight. Lovely. I'm glad you got it well, straight. Well, I've always had it straight. It's everybody else who's got it wrong. We've all ended <laughs> up in, 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 a, in our real lives mm. now. We've all, all of us, an, animal lovers. Yeah. You've got and how many dogs? I've got six, six dogs. You, 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 you I ended up with pussy cats. Yeah, no, pussy and cats. what about you then, Lizzie? What two horses, got? two dogs, two cats. And, and that was down to the program, life. was it? To a certain extent. Yes. Yes. It was. Yes. Yeah. It was. Yeah. Brilliant. Yeah. Um, You've mentioned the Blue Peter Garden. We're actually going to Carol Kirkwood, who is in the Blue Peter Garden, um, to tell us about the weather and a very famous place we're in as well, Carol. Yes, indeed, Louise, and there's a bust of Petra out here as well. But it's a chilly start to the day this morning, not just here in London, but across many parts of the country. We've also got some showers in the north of Scotland and western parts of the British Isles generally, some of them making good inroads across the Midlands and also into East Anglia. Now, the showers will continue through the course of the day. The wind is also going to strengthen across Caithness, Sutherland and Aberdeenshire for a time. It could even be touching gale force. But for the rest of us, lovely sunshine. That's it. Back to you. Oh, I'd never imagined when I watched Blue Peter all those years ago, and it was a few, that I would be sitting amongst such esteemed cast. It's amazing to be here. Thank you very much for coming on That's breakfast right. and coming back to the studio, all of you, and also to the dogs as well. And just finally, we are, after we, we've discussed it, we had a look at it, yeah. pulled it apart a bit, and you're going to get your badge. I'm this going to get my your, badge. Yes. And these are really sought after, aren't these they? What does it mean? I've made yes. them out of yes. gold. <laughs> Foil. So she's been making them for the last 12 months. After the last Isn't it? 12 yeah. years. It's all good. Look, so <gasps> there you go. Why is your nose it's going just... so long, Sarah? <laughs> I don't understand. <laughs> I'm um, very, very privileged. Yeah. Thank you all very much moon. indeed. No. That is it from Blue Peter on Breakfast. Breakfast Normal is back tomorrow morning. Goodbye, everybody. Bye. 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 Thank you very much. <laughs> Real Rescues.